Hello, I'm Carlos. In this video, I will showcase the nature brushes. I created one video for all categories because the brushes are exactly the same on each tool. It only changes the behavior. On pastel, they will show the paper texture when you use lower pressure with your stylus. On watercolor, the pigment will flow. On oil and express oil, they will not be impacted by anything. I created these brushes originally for watercolor, so I will showcase them with that tool. These aren't brushes to create complete scenes. They are only a support for your painting, to add some details and variety. Don't use only these brushes to paint a full nature scene, it will look too digital. I don't want it to include the two cloud brushes. There's better brushes for that purpose on all tools. But finally I included them. The watercolor version can achieve pretty good looking clouds. The ground brushes add details that resemble pebbles or details on the ground. Lower pressure put the details out lower sizes. You can use these brushes in blend mode to provide a more natural look. The ground details may be anything else, like leaves, rocks, pebbles. The petals brush is self-explanatory. The ground leaves look like fall leaves. The four leaf brushes provide different leaf stamps. I don't use real leaves for the stamps. Instead, I painted myself something that resemble leaves, but still look like brush strokes. The grass brushes are also stamps. Don't use only these brushes to paint grass, I will look too digital. If you wish, you can change the paint blending, like the layer blending modes. This is an usual workflow in software like Photoshop, it was included in Rebel 6. To do that, open the brush creator. Go to paint tab and select the blending mode in paint blending list. Use multiply to add darker green. Use overlay or screen to add highlights. Remember to restore the brush to default values.
There's four different grass brushes. One for tall grass. Other for short grass. Another for wide grass. The last one is for sparse grass. There's also two directional grass brushes. The last brush resembled dry grass. The plant brushes add a variety of plant stamps. As with leaves, I painted myself each plant to look more painterly. Each brush has the same brush tip repeated, but I flipped the second one horizontally. This provide more randomness. I show you how it looks the same brushes with different tools. This is all about the nature group. I hope you like the brushes.